welcome to another episode of Check Out Basket. Today we are checking out a new ice cream from Magnum or Streets Magnum. Um, and this is called the uh, Lux Raspberry Pina Cotta. That's right, a raspberry pina cotta. So, what does this raspberry pina cotta look like? Well, let's see if I can open up this box. Fish out some ice cream. So, it's not a huge ice cream, not like, you know, big things, so it's fairly small. Let's see what it looks like on the inside. And that's what it looks like on the inside of the pack. Secondly, I have my knife here. Let's cut this thing in half and see what else is inside here. Okay. Straight down the middle. Pull that stick. Get a look on the inside. Oh, look, there is, there's ooziness. There's chocolate on the outside. And there's... All different types. There's raspberry. That's the raspberry goo around the outside there, and uh, the 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 pina cotta on the inside. All right. Now I've cut one of these in half. It's time for me to give one of these ice creams, not a half an ice cream, to my offsider who sits off camera, who's going to help you and me figure a few things out. That's all right. It's taste test time. All right. So this pack only contains three of these things, not four. Not three. Four. Three. Three. It is nine dollars at Coles, not on special, um, and. Uh, they're not really that big either. So it works out to be $3 each. But I don't think Magnum are a big ice cream. Just oh, I've had bigger ones than this. They're just supposed to be nice. All right, let's go in before this one melts and uh, we'll get into the taste test. All right, in we go. Oh, I'm Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I like the raspberry. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that's three. Mmm. Only three. And it's nine dollars for the pack, so they're about three bucks each. That was very nice. That would be one of the nicest ice creams I think I've ever tasted. Very nice. Oh, that raspberry. I know. Oh, stinky, stinky. All right, let's get on with this one and give it a score. Mm. I can't give this one a score because I'm just chewing all the time. So I haven't got time to give it a score. Five. <laughs> the yep. five. Yep, yep, yep. All right, for me, this is overpriced. It's nine dollars for a pack of three, not even four, three. Yes. Um, so I'm giving it a. I have to take points off. One for the not being four in there, and another one for the price. So I'm giving it a three. You're giving it a, a five. So that's an eight out of ten. Just remember if you see anything you like in these videos, make sure you give us a big thumbs up, don't forget comments, questions, or maybe other ice creams you want us to try. Leave it in the comments below on YouTube. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and get notified when we do these. Check out past episodes of my daily vlogs, everybody's rolling with great car maintenance, you name it, I film it, it ends up on YouTube. So hit that subscribe button. And until next time, see you in the next video. Tell me, did you give it another bite before you gave it the points? I did. I ate it all. It, it went, it went it, in very you nicely. You still only gave it three points. Hey, the only reason I'm taking off is yeah, because of the price point. and they come, they come with three. Listen, listen, Without listen. those, it would have been a five. If we stand away from the price and just take the ice cream as the As it is, cream. it would have got a five. But oh, because easy. of the, but I have to, I have to put price invo uh, involved with, with these. Oh. And um, it's too, too pricey, especially at the supermarket. Oh. Sorry.